Hey guys, it's Narelle here, and welcome back to a new video. In this video, you're going to be seeing me color a index card drawing I did of Akari and Senna from Aikatsu Season 2. I actually made this drawing ages ago. I can't really remember when it was made, but I'm pretty sure it was made around April or May. So it was made a long time ago. Let's just put it at that. And the reason why this hasn't been uploaded yet is because I have commitments to a lot of things so this video just got pushed back and back and back and now I'm like I'm going to upload it because I'm tired of having it on my flash drive and I really do like this picture so yay so um this is actually a fan art I did because I actually shipped them heavily in the show I really loved how in season two the show gave more emphasis on them because with Aikatsu is an idol anime and with most idol animes they don't really give emphasis on relationships or ships I may be wrong but with this one it really didn't for the first season season but I really love how in season two they kind of gave Akari and Senna their alone moments and it was so flipping cute there will be more ship fan art with these two but I will not make them videos because I don't know I feel like I have to fangirl in my sketchbook sometimes but I really do like how this one turned out good thing is this will be available in my shop for purchase if you guys want it I still got my Ichigo piece up in my shop for purchase so maybe I'll make a deal thingy so if you buy both of the originals you get them um, a percentage off because I am actually trying to get rid of a lot of originals that I have in my house because you know you just want to make room for a lot more and I think I've sold about three originals so far which is really good and I appreciate it so um whoever has owned or is owned some of my originals thank you so much for buying them it really Really does mean a lot so if you guys are really interested in this piece whatsoever you don't have to be a fan of Aikatsu to buy it if you really honestly do like it go buy it because I really do like this piece and I would like people who like it too to have it and cherish it as much as I do so like I said I drew this drawing on an index card I drew it I think with the Prismacolor Kali Race pencil I don't know I know I inked it with a Prismacolor liner in the size of 03 I believe um, I'm coloring some parts of it with Copic markers and the rest with Prismacolors because like I said I don't really have a lot of colors in my Copic collection hopefully that will change if it doesn't I am more than happy enough with the brown um, and I actually use my metallic gold pen to do the crowns on their shirts because if you guys don't know Senna is actually Akari's clothing designer and his brand is called dreamy crown and I really wanted the crown to be really sparkly so after I drew it with the metallic pen I actually went over it with some glitter to make it sparkle and I'm like yes so the background I kind of wanted to change the colors because with the color palette of this brand it's actually yellow red and blue and I'm like that's so ugly so I just made it different variations of brown because I felt like that'll make the picture more natural and more warmer and I really did like that fact so sometimes you're gonna have to spice up your own pieces a little bit just to kind of make them stand out because I didn't really want to stick to this anime's color palette verbatim because I'm like it's my artwork so um yeah I did have a little bit of complications with some parts of their anatomy Senna I'm okay with but Akari I really feel like her neck threw off her body pose I should have shifted her neck a little bit over or tilted it a little bit over because it looks like she's like very stiff and awkward and I'm judging my own artwork because since this was done ages ago I can see where I messed up and as you can see they both have three fingers it's like whenever I do that hand position I can never get everyone's fingers to be counted so that's probably a hand pose I have to practice more with because I can see I'm not strong in it so yeah 
So, all in all, I had a lot of fun with this piece. And if you guys have never drawn on index cards, I recommend it wholly because they're so much fun to draw on. They're kind of like little pieces of cardstock, except they can't hold the quantity of blending that cardstock can. They can hold Copics really well. They do bleed, obviously, because it's thinner paper, but they can hold Copics. They can hold gouache. I have done gouache paper paintings on this paper before and watercolor I don't really think so but gouache is a definite yes because gouache is more soft than watercolor so it goes on a lot more smoother and creamy so you don't have to worry about the paper ripping or like warping and it's just all good so yay so that's about it for the peas and I'm just gonna update you guys with life situations um, as you guys may know I am actually working now so a lot of my time that I could be drawing, I'm not drawing because I have work for Monday through Thursday. I have to get up at 5 o'clock a.m. every day except Friday. So a lot of my sleeping time is lost in the only the only days where I can really sleep is Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Sunday, I go right back to my early schedule, so I really haven't been drawing a lot much, and I haven't really been in the mood to draw because I'm just too tired to draw. So I'm super sorry if you guys haven't seen any newer videos because I just haven't been in the mood to draw, guys. It's so saddening, and I'm like forever stuck in my tone tan schedule sketchbook like I could have been done with that but like I said I'm not in the sketching mood anymore like it's weird but that's just how adults are like when you're an adult you have your commitments and you have to stick to them so if your passion it kind of does drag a little bit it has to be that way because you have to go as best for you so if I happen to do one face that's a good thing for me because I'm not going to stop drawing I will actually keep drawing if it's like one thing a day that's enough for me but I will not get to the point where I don't draw at all for that whole day so um yes so I had something else to say, I wanted to say but I forgot oh I actually am doing a newer technique with my artwork as you guys saw when I was doing their faces I went back over it with colored pencil because I've seen a lot of artists do that with their artwork they'll do Copic artwork but go over to Copics with colored pencil and it looks really cool but now I'm using q-tips because q-tips actually blend the pencil out really well so thank God for new art techniques <laughs> that I haven't heard of before because they work amazingly so um yeah so i hope you guys kind of forgive me with my absence of all of my older original videos it's just that i'm an adult and sometimes life kills me you know but i'll make sure that i will come back with better videos and newer content that you guys would like and hopefully i can be more consistent with my mondays and fridays because i said a while ago that my mondays would be sketch with me's and i technically failed with that one because i only did one of those but i will get back to a time where mondays will most def be sketch with me's and fridays will either be a fan art video Video or a chat video or a sketchbook update because I really just don't want my channel to be all over the place so my video is wrapping up so thank you so much guys for loving me and supporting my lateness but um yeah so give this video a like if you like it give it a comment share it if you have friends that like I caught to as well and yeah so thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video and oh I'm using the background music by by a person I will link him in my description and on my screen because I love this cover he did of this song so bye guys